Alright guys, welcome back to JForce Gaming and are you in a spot where you have to deal with a lot of PDF documents either at work or study or do you feel like you are drowning in PDFs, constantly switching between documents, editing or searching for key information? What if there is a smarter way that can help you handle all documents more efficiently and even with the help of AI to assist you? Well, you're in luck today because there is a software that do exactly this for you and it is with the help of this software right here. Right? So this is the Wondershare PDF Element 11 and this is a really, really great tool all right, for you to edit your PDF files. All right? As you know, if you know, like PDF are very, very troublesome because most of the PDF files are very hard to edit on and if you want to edit you know um, PDF file you probably have to pay for you know Adobe Acrobat in order for you to edit PDF document but what if there is a solution that can help you edit the PDF files or right, move the pictures around edit every text every layout in the PDF document and plus with the help of AI to help you summarize it help you translate it all right and help you do a lot a lot of stuff that save you a lot of time and increase your productivity all right so this is a PDF PDF edit uh, tool that I'm using for a very long time, or right, especially you know as a content creator, or right, I receive a lot of emails and the sponsors mail, and as a student myself, all right, we I do a lot of PDF, you know, editing, and you know if I want to use the free online tools, probably like you know from online, all right, they are very limited and very limited things that you can do on your PDF files. All right, but with this, all right, I can do a lot of things and help me increase my productivity and especially save me a lot of time. So this is a really, really awesome tool. And right now, I'm going to show you guys how this thing actually works and I'm going to give you some demonstration to it. So without further ado, let me just go ahead and show you guys the software itself. Let's go. Okay, so once you have downloaded it, it will look something like this, all right, and yeah, there's a lot of functions that you can do. So for first of all, all right, let me just show you the, the, the function that, you know, most people would need, especially me, I would need it is to edit a PDF. So how do you edit a PDF, all right? So you guys can, uh, you know, I have this, um, I have this folder over here, all right, that is called sample PDF. I have a few PDF over here, all right, I'm going to just uh, open one PDF file, probably like from this one, I'm going to just drag and drop it in. All right, and after that, bam, all right, so this is a PDF file, and to show that, you know, it is a PDF file, all right, I want to open up this file, all right, let me just open this up um, using uh, probably like Google Chrome, you guys can see it's a PDF file, so it's a dot .PDF file, and you know, PDF file, you cannot edit anything at all, you can only print, and you can't edit a PDF file, even if you put it in Microsoft Word, you cannot edit it, so with this tool, all right, I can able to edit all the things, so you can edit every single text right over here, if I go to edit all, Right, let's click edit all so all you can see everything right here all can be edited all the text all can be edited all right so i can just you know change whatever text i want you guys can see i can change all right i can delete this part of the text all right i can change the headline i can change all this you guys can see all this and the best part is i can also shift the text around so you know it's not constrained to that part all right most of the free online tool probably they use to edit pdf all right they can't even shift this around so you know you're constrained to the part so sometimes maybe if you make a mistake in the pdf and you want to edit all right, that's pretty much not a way to edit that all right unless you have the original you know, file um from the from the you know the, the provider or what all right so this is the one i can do it and you can also shift the image around so if you find that you know and it is by every layer of the image can you see all right there is so many layers of this image right over here all right so if i shift this part out all right it's just this this part only so you can shift like every part you guys can see every single one inside this thing all right all right from this part if you go click on the image itself all right you also have a lot of other tools that you guys can do and a lot of other intelligence tools like i said in the start of the video this thing also compromises using ai with the help of ai or to help you make your life much simpler all right so these are the few uh tools that you guys can you can crop the image all right save and you can copy the image all right so these are pretty basic things all right they do have some ai built in all right you guys can use this to generate image so if you find that like, you know this image is not sufficient enough all right you guys can prompt the AI to do you know what you want what you don't want to see or you can choose the, uh, the, the image size and you know a uh, type of image that you want you want me to be animate type all right watercolor type all right lifelike this and that you guys can 
permit to generate for you so you don't have to go to google and then type in the image you want and search through like all the image and scroll through all the you know it has ai to generate is fast efficient and save you a lot of time all right they also do have that you can replace the image you guys can upload and render image and replace it the same size that it is or you can extract text in the image all right you guys can also translate the text in the image as well and they also have like intelligence image editing so you guys can use this you can use this to um, erase remove background upscale enhance and generative field so there's a lot of things that you guys can do this with this using ai so you don't have to like you know if you if you are the one that created this image or somebody's the one that created this image but you find that you know it's missing some parts and such or you find that you know it is too you know there's a lot of background and all this effect right instead of going to photoshop and re-edit the image you can just do it over here with the help of ai with just a click of a few buttons and you guys can get the perfect image you want so this is really really useful too all right and they have this um um yeah that's mostly about it about editing it all right they still have a lot of functions right over here all right and you guys can see on the right here there's this property types all right so you guys can change the the text font so if you like you know if you like find this the whole thing the font here it's a bit like not so nice you guys can change to like you know, change the font you can change it easily you can change the color as well all right all this you can change all right as as your own wish all right there's no limit to what can be changed what can be changed you can adjust the spacing you can have certain action like flip the text this and that all right and you guys can do all this all right very very easy and mo all of the all those parts all right in the pdf can be edited even this like this diagram over here all the every single text here all can be edited that is really amazing and i think this is the most all right, comprehensive pdf editor all right that i've used and this thing can do so much stuff all right and over here over over here you can add some text all right so obviously you don't need to edit all right for you to find some text missing you can add a certain text over here as well all right it's yellow let me just change the black so you guys can see it much better all right, yeah, so you can add certain text as well. You can add images, all these to a PDF, all right. A really good thing. And especially got one feature I love most is this OCR. What does OCR do is basically if you if you scan a document, all right, from your scanner or your printer and you scan it into your system, all right, it will show the scanned document. And the best thing about this is you can edit the text that is scanned in. That is really, really crazy. And that is awesome, all right. And this thing is really, really helpful. So if you scan a document in and you find like, you know, there's something wrong with the document, all right, either you reprint it or you ask someone to, you know, do it again and reprint it for you, all right, or you can just edit on the spot that is very very useful you can crop you can search for a specific word as well all right and uh, there's a lot of things and there's an ai assistance as well so with the help of ai assistant you guys can use the ai chat to ask like you know um probably that you do you will reading through the pdf and you find out like, oh, who, uh, who is lastro zubarski all right so if you don't know what's that or right, you just you will ai assistant ai chat all right and check with pdf or check with ai i'm going to check with ai for basically and I just search who is all right, it can help your studying much easier. So if you, let's say if you're studying about you know uh, anatomy, all right about the skin surface and such, all right, and um yeah you read through this term and you're not so sure the AI is right over here. You can just ask all right what is that? What is this term about? This and that. All right, what is continuous receptors? All right, you guys can see Lasso Sapolsky blah, blah blah blah. All right, so you can see all right. Uh, if, if I copy this, it's also, it automatically paste it over here. You, if you guys see it, all right. So this is very helpful. So I just like you know I just need to copy this. All right, and it's just right over here. So if I like choose this part, you guys can see it's automatically updated over here. I don't think you guys can see. I have to like uh, move my logo out of the way. Yeah, let me move it out of the way. All right, you guys can see. All right. So every time I select a text, or if I select this part of text, all right, it automatically updates here. So it's very very useful. All right. So if I selected this text, all right, also my other here I just send to the AI and just like see what they say. Okay, let me just move myself back down here. Alright, so yeah, and it shows, oh, okay, oh, okay, so, so it helps you with your studying much easier, so, you know, you don't have to, like, you know, open up Chrome and search what is it about and, and look through all the articles, right, it's all summarized it well here for you, save you so much time for researching, alright, and they also have, like, AI summarize, so you summarize, like, this whole document is about, alright, you can translate, Alright, you can grammar check. This one Tracy I'm gonna show you later on. Alright, you can like, check for grammar, so make sure that you know all the things that you're submitting, all the works are you know uh, properly, you know, grammarized. So it's not like you know missing an S or alphabet or this and that. Alright. You can use AI generate to generate into a PowerPoint slide as well. Alright, generate a markdown and generate a mind map. That's very, very useful. So especially in work, even most of the time if uh, you know boss hand you this PDF and they'll say 
um, you know, take out the important information of this PDF and make it into a PowerPoint slide to present to our clients. All right. Most of the time, I think probably if you work in, you know, um, office environment, you should know that, you know, or you work in a corporate environment, you should know that this is a very common thing. All right. And, you know, with this, you just need to click one single button and you can have a PPT all generated out for you. That's really, really incredible, right? Uh, maybe I'll demonstrate this for you later on and you can have an AI writing detect. So, um, yeah, you will, you, will, you, will, you will detect, like, you know, your, your writing if it's correct or if there's something wrong with it all right um yeah so you can see this is human return all right so because this is done by one of the professors in one of the university you guys can see if he documented it so you guys can see you can check that you know if someone submitted this to you is it using ai or is it human return so this is human return so it's very very useful too you guys can edit you guys can comment on certain area you guys want it to comment on like you know this part area might be wrong or what and you want people to change it or update it all right you guys can do that as well you guys can convert to other kinds of files document like word excel powerpoint all this and that you guys can do that as well all right other features also including like view you guys can ai read more so if you like lazy to read you just put on your headset and just you know really all right read a lot rotate view all this all right they have so many so many features if i were to go through every single feature here all right probably this video will be very long and very boring all right but yeah these are the features you guys can see over here all right if you have seen this all right it will work on any pdf so it's very very awesome they have various tools over here all right it's combine compress compare and batch multiple pdf together all right the form itself you guys can you know, add few at a radio button add a like you know a drop down menu all this and that you can add calendars as well right over here and bam all right so you can as the field, you can add like where what to sign, you can extract the data, you can protect it. So you can protect your PDF, you guys can encrypt it. All right, you guys can add like you know, um, sign, uh, a request an e sign, you guys can do that as well. So more of the time, you know, most PDF document requests e sign, you guys can do this using this tool as well. So I sign the client, client for them to sign it. All right, yeah, you can see all this all over here as well. I can do that as well. All right, but let me just go ahead and focus on the AI part as well. All right, so if I go and open another PDF document, let me just open a sample DBA. This is probably another one. It's a dry, about dry lab of Silicon Valley and such. All right, so let me just so if like probably it's a very long article. All right, for this one, this is a sample PDF. It's not that long, all right? And um, some of PDF are like two hundred pages long. All right, and you and you probably don't want to waste your time reading through everything. Just use this, all right, or you can just click on this, all right. So that's very helpful too over here. All right, all this AI tool, and you just click on summarize with PDF, all right, and just wait a while and let the AI do its job, and you know you end up summarize all the important key factors out for you, and you know, it's a very very great you know companion and a great body to you as well, all right. So you guys can see, all right, all this you can also edit as well. You can click on edit all, and you know all the text, all this. The image can be replaced, can be edited, all right, all this font, all can be edited. All right, while I'm speaking, all right, the PDF has already summarized it, so you guys can see, all right, um, uh, what is this newsletter about, the company development, and blah, 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 blah. And um, they also come up with a few questions that you might want to know, probably like, you know, uh, what's the total new capital raised by Trilab in January 2017, all right, because it is it's talk about, you know, um, um, 2017 the dry light newsletter so you guys can click on it all right um the the ai will help you probably search the internet as well and plus you know the information from the pdf to give you a very distinctive answer to it all right as you guys can see this is the the answer generated by ai i think that's really really good and very very detailed or right, you can also generate a mind map out of it as well out of this whole pdf documentation all right it's deep thinking as well it's really awesome you guys see this is the whole mind map as well all right all the key points so yeah you can use it to generate a mind map for you as well all right and like i say all right most of the time you know maybe if you're working in a corporate em environment most of the time you know the boss will hand you this pdf and you convert to powerpoint so you just click on this and convert this to powerpoint and you can output as powerpoint pptx or ppt or you know jpeg and charge all right all right so i'm just going to select powerpoint slides all right you can adjust other settings as well all right name and okay save to soft folder i'm gonna just save it to my um desktop all right just save it to des right, desktop easier to assess all right it's converting it into pdf all right it's converting and it's converted into powerpoint slides all right if you guys have seen my desktop all right where is the this is the powerpoint but i can open it on 
on my computer because my F or my Microsoft Office is not working. Opening Google Slides. So let's see what it have generated for me. All right. So this is a PowerPoint that they created for me. Really cool. All right. So yeah, you can turn it into PowerPoint as well. You guys can see. All right. So you can use it to present, right? You know, to people. Very very awesome and very useful too. All right. That's that's why I love about this thing is that you know it's very very flexible. You can convert and convert anything you like anywhere you want you know and the AI assistant is really really good as well all right and let me just show you one another part is the AI translate one so this is probably a PDF document that is in Chinese you guys can see right over here all right so probably if you have a you see a PDF doc document probably if you do a lot of like you know shipping and charge all right you deal with like a lot of distributors around the world and some of them you know, send a PDF or you know, user manual in PDF form either in a foreign language you, know, you don't understand in Japanese Chinese Spanish all right and you can just use this to help you translate it for you so you can word translator or PDF translator all right I'm just going with PDF translator all right I'm gonna just translate it okay and um, I don't know why it's there twice okay so I just open the PDF that's translated and you guys can see all right it has been translated to that translator this to German uh, I think I translated this to German let me just oh yeah yeah I translate this to German all right I'm gonna translate this to English all right so yeah you guys can translate to any language that you are in so if you are if you, you mainly speak German, all right, you guys can translate it to German as well, all right? Let me translate it to English, all right? <laughs> um, <laughs> that's why I was confused for a while. All right, okay, so I'm going to open it up, all right? And yeah, it has been translated to English. You guys can see, all right, what this text is about, all right? And once you've translated it, all right, you can also edit the translated one. That is really cool. Also. So you can edit, like, you know, any certain text and the delete this text all right and yeah you guys can see it's been translated you guys can read so you know understand what the pdf is about so it's it's very very cool all right and super super useful and super efficient and you can do all the things that you want on the translated pdf so yeah you guys can translate any language you want from you know, a foreign language into something that you can understand so it's very very useful too and i think i'm i believe that this is the only pdf editor tool that is this comprehensive all right and you know, this useful. Um, I've used a lot of PDF tools in the past, free online tools, paid online tools, and, and even Adobe Acrobat as well, right? And I tell you, none of them come even close to this. But right, there is still so much more features and you know, the things that you guys can do using this editor alone. But you know, I couldn't possibly run through everything because if not, this whole video will be very long. This video has been really long already. So uh, yeah, let's not keep it longer. But yeah, you guys can have a general idea of what you can do on this. And with the help of AI Assistant, all right, that is built into this, it helps you save you so much time when you are, you know, um, researching, you're reading through the PDF, or it can summarize for you, it can create a mind map for you, it can, it can you know, help you understand what certain terms mean, it can help you translate, it can help you, like, you know, add in, use AI to generate additional image, edit the image, remove background, all this and that, right? all just by using this tool. You don't need any third-party software to do that anymore from now onwards, all right? So if you're doing anything that's related to PDF, all right, you can do every single thing to editing, to images, to every, to translation, or using this tool. You don't need to use like separate thing like, you know, Photoshop to edit the photos. You don't need like, you know, a translator like Google Translate, all this to translate, all right? All can be done for you. You don't need like, you know, upload a PDF document into like ChatGPT or open or like you know uh, other AI tools all right for you to help you summarize it all can be done within this software itself so it's very very awesome and now you know why I like this software so much so yeah if you guys want to check out this software right here right you guys can check out the first link in the description down below all right and download it for yourself and you find that you know it's really useful and you want to use the full features definitely highly recommend you guys to get you know the paid version it will be very very worth it and the amount of time safe is in uh, inaccumulable all right and it's, this one also supports like not only on windows but you can use it on android mac ios and you can use the online tool as well they have an online tool as well so you can use the online tool as well or right, you don't have to download the software itself so yeah it's really really awesome really comprehensive all right and i'll link them the first link in the video description down below for you guys to go ahead and check it out all right so yeah that's all for today guys if you find this video really interesting and really help you all right and to solve your solution to your PDF problems, alright, you guys can give it a thumbs up. And without further ado, this is JForce Gaming, and I shall see you guys in my next video. Peace out. I don't wanna cry.